what is the whole point of a carbon? A carbon is to make a person pure. If a person has for shalom committed a sin, committed a chait, what does he do to cleanse himself, to purify himself? He brings a carbon. Therefore, I want children who are pure to learn about the purity of carbonus. But still, it doesn't answer the complexity. He brings an analogy to a villager. He heard that there was a new creation, a car. He took all his savings, and he wanted to buy this new innovation. He went to Ford, happily gave them the cash, and purchased his new vehicle. He's driving it all around the village, up and down the streets. He's so proud of himself, driving this new shiny car. After a few days of driving around and showing off his vehicle, it suddenly stops. Right on its tracks. Comes out of the car. He's dismayed. He's disappointed. All his money for nothing. This car's a lemon. It stalled. It broke down. He meets one of his friends and acquaintance. He says, I just purchased this vehicle. A lot of money. And the thing broke down already. His friend says, you need gas. The car operates on gas. He says, gas? Gas is putrid. It smells. And it costs money. I already spent enough money on this car. Why would I put something that smells and costs money into my vehicle? His acquaintance responded, Because that's what it's going to take to have your car continue to operate and run. A car runs on gas. Without gas, your car won't go anywhere. You may not understand that because you didn't design the car. You don't understand that the car is designed to operate on gas. If Shin Shin Pinka says the same thing with learning carbonus, we don't understand The neshama. You know why? We didn't design the neshama. The Rebbein Shalaylam did. The Rebbein Shalaylam took the neshama from underneath his heavenly throne and he placed the neshama inside every single person. Every single guf. And he knew that in order for the neshama to thrive, they need gas. You know what the gas of the neshama is? Learning carbonus. Just like the neshama is pure, learn about carbonus, so pure. And then the neshama will thrive and succeed. And that's why it's so important to teach children, starting with Vayikra, even though it's difficult.